what's up guys hey nasty worm bringing you a, a pre alpha this is uh, the pre game release of Conan Exiles um, I played a little bit of it this morning I dabbled with it whatever so what I wanted to give you guys is just the, the character customization just a little tutorial a little overview on the different customizations you can do um, over time they are talking about doing um, doing a bunch of updates at the moment when you actually exit out of the game it will pop up with a window for you to um, put in some I guess some some critiquing, if you will, some some suggestions on what the game should need, some bug errors, whatever, lag issues, optimization issues, uh, rendering issues, um, you know, shit like that. So um, they're really serious about making this a good game. It, it reminds me a lot of Rust, um, but I, I like it actually, guys, a lot better than Rust. So if, if you like this video, please uh, drop me a like, uh, subscribe for future content, and let me know down below if you want to see um, gameplay of this game. Um, and I will do my best to provide you guys with that game gameplay. Without further ado, let's get into this. So for this, I'm just going to go over the male's version. Um, the female version's the same deal. So you just click on ma male here, obviously. Um, and there you go. It's a little bald dude, right? <clears throat> you can uh, either ran randomize it, right? Or you can um, just hit next, and it will it'll go to the next region here. But we're going to go back to race, um, and we'll start at the first one here. So, And it will give you a brief description down here, guys. Hyborion, I think that is. Um, and you guys can read that. I'm, I'm just not going to go over all of it here. Um, and then you got your Sumerian, uh, your Stygian. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing these right, guys, but whatever. Bear with me. Uh, tribal Himalayan. Um, I'm not even... Um, Hercanian or Tur Turanian, I guess. That sounds about right. Uh, you got your uh, Kitan. That sounds pretty cool. Known to be mysterious and secretive. I like that. All right. Uh, uh, Kashite or Kashit, whatever you want to uh, pronounce that. Uh, Nordheimer. Peaked or Pit, whatever. Uh, Shemite. Uh, Defari. Vandhyan. Uh, Zamorion. And uh, Zingaran. Um, yeah, so for this, I'm just going to, you know, whatever. I'll pick Zingaran, right? So let's hit next. So now you go into your races, okay? Um, if I'm not mistaken, different races can summon different um, ancient uh, beings. Like this one right here, the set, obviously you, you spawn in um, a snake, right? Um, this one right here is like a, I believe this one, the Yogg, is a flying octopus looking thing. And uh, the Mitra is like an iron golem, like giant type deal. I don't know what the Krom is though, to be honest with you. So um, I'm just going to go with, um, let's go with Mitra. The gods good. are watching. All right, and here's the voices. They're pretty cool. Cut me down, please. That's your first one. Death is coming. Second. Cut me down, please. Third. Death is coming. There you go. Death is coming. There you go. Six one. The six one gets me, man. I like the six one. Ah! <laughs> that was not bad. We're gonna go with the six one, guys. All right. So now you go into head options. You got your different faces. Boom. So I'm going to go with that one there. He looks angry. Uh, and you can pick the different colors of his skin, as you can see here. You can go, like, all the way, like, he's been scarred from the sun. Um, sorry, that, was, uh, that, that wasn't racist at all, guys. I apologize. Um, this really dark, really light. I apologize. Um, I'm going to go I'm gonna go with, like, this guy's, like, borderline. Uh, yeah, he's powder looking here. We'll go with him. Cool. All right, and then you got your different hairs. These are your different styles. You got the the He-Man Warrior. Got it. Boom. That one's pretty cool, though. I might go with the little sideways one. That guy looks freaky as shit. He looks like a pedophile. This one's just missing the freaking uh, the mustache. That's Joe Dirte right there, Joe Dirt. He's just missing his hat. Oh, wow, maybe that's Joe Dirt. I don't know. All right. But I think we're going to go with this guy here. I like that. And then, again, you can pick the different um, the colors of it. Um, it's pretty cool. I'm going to go with white. Pretty legit. All right, then you got your eyebrows here as well. Um, yeah, it's just it's easily just click through it. Boom. It's not that hard. Um, and I think I'm going to go with I'll go with that guy. All right, and then, again, you pick the different colors you want. Again, I'm just I'm going all white, guys. Uh, facial hair, he doesn't have any, so I'm just going to go all white. Cosmetics. These are, um, if I'm not mistaken, it's by the eyes. Yeah, it's by the eyes. There we go. Yeah. Ooh, 
that's pretty cool right there. And then you got your eye shadow as well, which is on the outside of the eyes, as you can see. Boom. That's no, actually pretty cool. I'm cool with that. All right, cool. Then you got face details, right? You got the, the width. I'm going to go really wide. And you got the chin. Yeah. Cheek, same thing. Just all width. There's whatever you guys want to customize, however you guys want to do it. Um, I mean, it's up to you guys. It's your character. Um, they're very user-friendly, very um, easy to customize here. It's not hard at all. You got the nose here. Um, I like how user-friendly it is that they've made this customization. It's, it's pretty simple. It'd be really cool if, uh, you know, um, Face Punch on Rust would um, implement something like this. I know they've talked about it in the future. Um, I mean, in the past, they've talked about it implementing it in the future, but it's never happened. Um, then you got your ears. You can go in, out, whatever you want to do. I'm going to go out. And then you can make them really big, really small, whatever you want to do. Then you got your eyes. Big, small, whatever. I'm going to go right there. You got your angle. Angle on uh, outward or in. Uh, whatever you want to do. And then the spacing. Yeah, let's do that. Guy looks freaking weird. And then you got your eye color. Yeah, he looks dark. I like that. And then body features. So you can go extremely small or you can go tall. Uh, make him like a freaking gi gigantic motherfucker. Whatever you want to do. Um, I'm going to go medium. Uh, that's not medium. Uh, about right there is medium. And then you got your physique, right? Um, physique, whatever. Um, breast size, you can go huge. And you know what's funny about this is if you actually make your guy crouch really fast, jumps up, his boobs actually jiggle. Um, yeah, so, you know, it's not bad. Um, we'll go here. Partial, full. Oh, my bad. You didn't see that. Oh, God. You just saw his dink dink. I apologize, guys. Um, yeah, sorry for all you young kids out there that saw that. <clears throat> oh, okay, you didn't see that. And then once you once you get done, obviously, you're going to hit finalize character. Boom. And what you can do, you can, um, here hangs, you enter your name, um, that's your, your character, religion, whatever you picked. Uh, condemned to death and exile for crimes including, um, Deb, what is that, Deb ar Archery? Uh, strangling a money lender, uh, decapitation of a priest. All right. Any who remove this body, living or dead, from the cross will be flayed alive along with all members of their family. So if this is what you like or whatever, you just hit confirm, and then you have the little cut screen. I'll let you guys watch that real quick, the little cut scene. I mean, you guys can skip it, too, down at the bottom. Uh, press escape to skip or whatever. It's whatever you guys want to do. There he is, Conan the Barbarian. <laughs> Alright, well that was pretty much it right there, guys. Um, Hope you enjoyed it. Now the game's loading in, but um, it was supposed to do a cutscene. I don't know what happened there. I guess that did this come out with a uh, recent update. Um, I guess they jacked up the cutscene. It was supposed to be a pretty decent cut cutscene. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this, um, I know it was a quick little uh, tutorial overview video of the character customization of the game. Very simple. Um, if you did like this video, please uh, drop a like. Subscribe for future content. Also check out my Twitter page. Um, you know I'm always active on there. Um, I appreciate you guys for uh, coming out. Thanks again. Peace out. Yeah.